Hey there everybody, Jerry here from Android Central and we're gonna take a look at the new download manager. It's part of Gingerbread. We're showing it off on the Nexus S, but uh, it's not hardware dependent. As soon as your phone gets Gingerbread, you'll have this one too. It's just a new application that's built into the operating system. I happen to know where there's a file for download and we're right here on the Android Central page. And we come down here to this four square post with the link to the test file they want people to try. We'll go ahead and hit it. And that looks the same as what we're used to. You get a little toast notification that says your download starting. Up in the status bar, you get the arrow. Uh, in Gingerbread, that arrow turns green when it's active. This is, you know, a fairly small file and we're on Wi-Fi. Didn't get a chance to do that. But if you download something big, you'll see it flash, you know, in a series of green every now and then. We open that up. That's just what we're used to in Froyo and Eclair. Tap it and it goes to the application that you know will open this file. In this case, it's the installer. We don't want to do that. What we do want to do is look at the download manager. So we'll open it. And there it is. There's the file you just downloaded. You can tap it and it does the same thing. It opens it with the correct app. Uh, you know, if you download a picture, it opens it with the gallery. In this case, it's an APK file, so it opens it with the installer. We can install or cancel. I want to cancel that. You have some options if you select it. You can delete or clear the selection. You know, if you've got a bunch of them there and you want to delete them, you know, quickly, you can just tap through. I don't want to do either just yet because I want to show you. We've got Astro on here so we can look in the downloads and back out so you can see. In the download folder, uh, there's a picture I downloaded earlier. There's the APK file that we just downloaded. It goes to the same spot, just a quick way to get to it. And if you do down or erase it from your download manager, let's go ahead and delete that. My download manager is empty. It doesn't delete the file. We'll go up and refresh just to be sure. That way you can, you know, you don't lose the file if you delete it from your download manager by mistake. It stays where it's supposed to be. It just deletes it from the interface. Uh, you know, for most people, this is a nice little addition, but for you guys out there that do a lot of side loading or downloading a bunch of stuff off the internet on your phone, this is really nice. You can download a bunch of stuff and go through and have a quick way to access a list of what you've downloaded later. And I'm glad to see it come. Uh, Everybody be on the lookout for gingerbread. Like I said, when you get it on your phone, you'll have this to play with too. In the meantime, you all have fun. I'll see you later.